Hey guys, it's Craze here. Welcome back to another Nitro Type video. And in today's video, as you guys read from the title, today we will be talking about mystery boxes. Yeah. So, for those of you who don't know, mystery box is pretty much like a free chest that you're able to open once every day, and you get some cool stuff in it. Except, with the new update, with the new level system, season 28, no more nitros in the game, like, no more, like, purchasable or, you know, buyable nitros, um, you know, the mystery box doesn't have a lot of stuff in it. And I don't know if any of you have noticed this before, but it has come to my attention that the only thing that you can actually get inside of a mystery box is cash. And really, the only amounts of cash you can get are either 7500 or 15000 So it's really not that much. And you're opening it once a day, so you have to wait an entire 20 hours to get an amount of cash that you can do in about five races. So today we will be talking about some ideas that I'd like to see added um, in the game for like a mystery box. And of course, you know, for, well, really for only the mystery box. But yeah, and this has to be fixed because, you know, I don't think anyone has actually noticed this yet, but it's seriously, the only thing that you can get is cash, and before you, you you were able to get nitros and XP and all this other stuff that has since been removed. So yeah, okay, so I have five ideas for this thing. So the first idea is larger cash prizes. And this would be anywhere from 50k to 100k at random times. And I just think that would be a little better than the standard... $7,500 that you could complete in, once again, five races, really. It's not that hard to get that amount of cash. And seeing as how 100 k is like the lowest amount of cash that you can send to a player, I just thought that would be like a good ma max for the mystery box. And of course, like 50 k and then anywhere in between those two numbers. Okay, so the second one is new cars. Yeah, so I don't, so I already know that there are two cars that you can get in the mystery box, but I'm pretty sure most of the people, like most of the people who play this game or have been playing this game for at least a year already have these two cars. So they're not that hard to get, especially since I'm pretty sure they increased the chances a while back. Like, I got these two cars in the same week. Um, after, like, of a year of playing the game, I got the cars in the same week. So, I don't know if they increased the chances of getting them recently, or they just wanted to, you know, make sure everyone had them, something like that. But these three cars right here, this is the achievement car. They're super easy to get, and most people who play the game have them. So I thought, oh, what would be better than a, you know, just putting a new car in. And for the new cars, it would probably be unreleased or unfinished. That way the Nitro Type team doesn't have to spend a whole ton of time making like a brand new car. They can use like a scrapped car or like an unfinished car. So for the car ideas, I was thinking um, for these, I was thinking we could have maybe the MSG-01 which, if you guys don't know, is an unreleased car um, that has been used for skins such as, what's it called? Uh, the Heartbreaker and the Something Wicked. So those are two cars that have been reskinned. And yeah, so, you know, yeah. Obviously, right here, it's a pretty cheap car. As you can see, buy price is 100 sell price for 60 and paints for 15 Now, I don't know if that would ever be increased. Maybe it could be, you could buy it for 100000 sell for 60000 and it would paint for 15000 I don't know. That would probably be a better, uh, like, idea. But this could be one, as you can see right here, reskin of this car was released during Season 24, and then another version in Season 26. So, 
So that's that a car for an idea. And then the other two are the 67 Veti. I think that's how you pronounce it. And then this is the same thing. Just an unreleased car, right? That was uh, found in the source code. So pretty, you know, pretty simple. Dealership section and achievement car. So that's obviously, that's what I'd say. Like, like this would probably be a better one especially since it was originally made as an achievement car. This would probably be better for like a mystery box car. And then the last one, which is another unreleased car, is the Fort Stallion. And those are the three cars. I wouldn't want to have three cars. I was thinking maybe only one. That would probably be better uh, to have only like one car rather than releasing a bunch. Because I think finding five cars from a mystery box is just a little unnecessary. Okay, so if we go back to Nitro Type over here. Okay, so the next thing that I would do is stickers or loot in general. And if you guys don't know what loot is, it's the thing right here, the view your loot button. This is all we have right now, which are some stickers, except coming soon, season 29 and further. There are going to be more, uh, like, more things released, like trails and, like, name tags, things like that. So, that would be kind of cool to see if there were, like, other things released and they would add those in too. But I have a couple ideas for the stickers. So, my first idea for a sticker would be, like, a cash. I wasn't thinking anything too crazy, just, like... Like the little cash icon or maybe a couple of them, you know, because why not, you know? Um, actually, let me go back back to the uh, view loot page because there are a couple things like that. There's like the nitro balloon. And I was thinking of doing the nitro balloon like that, but since it's already in the game, I couldn't have that one down. So I was saying, oh, you know, like cash, that's another thing that's in the game. Um, then I was thinking like a treasure chest. Because you're opening a mystery box and then you can like show, you know, like on the racetrack that, oh, you open a bunch of mystery boxes and you got this. And it would be like a treasure chest opening or whatever. I don't know. And then riches. So for this one, I was just thinking of like maybe like uh, rubies, diamonds or emeralds, you know, like something that you would find in in a chest, like, you know, like in an actual treasure chest. Um, okay, so then for a couple more simple ones, I was thinking of gestures, and this would be like emojis or hand gestures, because right now we only have one, one of those in the game, and I'm pretty sure we need like a little more like a thumbs up, or like a peace symbol, I don't know, so that would be pretty cool to find some of those in there, and then maybe some emojis as well. Um, okay, so my next one is like a clove for like luck you know like getting lucky or whatever like a four leaf clover oh you got lucky and found it something like that that would be pretty simple and then a bucket of gold to show riches once again same same thing as like the diamonds rubies and then the last one that i had uh is a skull and f for the skull it would be like you know when you find like a treasure chest in movies or things like that there's usually, or sometimes, there is, like, a dead person sitting around the chest. So I thought there would be, like, a skull, and that would be, like, the protector of the chest. And then, yeah, you'd find the skull, and yeah, you get the point. Okay, so for the next thing, um, I would, I was thinking that we could have more achievements. And what I mean by this is, right now, there are four achievements that you can get for opening uh mystery boxes right so i was thinking th this is just not enough okay 200 mystery boxes ever anyone can do that within the first year of playing and then it's done you don't get anything else besides cash right now for the rest of the time you play this game so uh what i was thinking is they could have more achievements that go all the way up to a thousand mystery boxes. And I think that would also be good because it would motivate it would motivate players like, you know, kids in school 
right? Like kids like me who are younger, it would motivate them more to actually play the game because they'd be getting something out of it. Because I know I have a lot of friends that do play Nitro type only when they're in school. I'm probably one of the only like, per I'm me like as a person. I'm the only person I know who actually like plays Nitro type as a, an as a game rather than an educational program at school that they have to do for 10 minutes or whatever it is. So I think this would just be better to uh, motivate players and have them play for longer times. So for achievements, I was thinking titles, loot, and possibly a car. And then this would obviously go up to a thousand open mystery boxes. And yeah, that, that would be a, a good idea, I think. And then for the car, my thoughts were doing something like this. And if you guys don't know what kind of car this is, this is one of the Lamborghinis in the dealership that's reskinned. And I think this would just look really, really cool. Like this is a, this is such a cool car. I think it would be really good for maybe 800, uh, you know, 800 mystery boxes or a thousand mystery boxes. And then obviously cash prizes, like things like this, maybe for opening 800 mystery boxes, you could get a million or 800,000. Think, you know, simple things like that. And then for my last idea, um, this would be a free slash extra mystery box. And I don't know if you guys know this, but there are a lot of mobile games that I have played where you can open a mystery box. You can like open like a chest to get something. And then you have the option to spin again for like watching an ad. So you can like watch an ad to spin again. Now, obviously that wouldn't work because a majority of nitro type, nitro type players have gold and gold is obviously an uh, ad free ex experience. So this would be something where you could earn an extra mystery box when opening a mystery box. And then pretty much what this would mean is that you could open two or, you know, two or possibly three a day because you could earn another free box in your free box. That makes sense. And yeah, I just think that would be a, a cool feature. And that would also like make players want to open their boxes more, right? Because when you're inactive on Nitro type, you're not going to log in just to open your mystery box. But with these newer features and these new things that they possibly add, I think it would just be better for the game, especially since right now the only thing that you can get is cash. But with that being said, that's gonna be the end of today's video. I can't believe I talked for 13 minutes straight already. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, let me know in the comment section down below what ideas you would want to see or what things you would want to see in a mystery box. Don't forget to subscribe, like the video, turn on post notifications, and I'll see you guys in the next one.